G'day Ziggy D here and Heart of the Swarm is here. Pretty exciting stuff. As you can see I'm downloading my copy here while I'm updating the old StarCraft client so I can then download the uh, Heart of the Swarm. It's probably going to take a little bit, a little while on uh, Australian internet but in the meantime I have a giveaway to, uh, to do. I have two copies of Heart of the Swarm to give away to you guys. So I had something like, if I go back over to random.org, 172 people enter into this giveaway on uh, Facebook. There's a few extra people that I had to disqualify using shifty accounts, like uh, accounts named you mad bro with a, a meme face. So uh, if you guys are going to make fake accounts, at least make them not so obvious. <laughs> so I discounted a few people like that. But overall, people didn't multiple comment and things like that. And it was, it was a great giveaway. I thought it went very smoothly. Uh, so I have everyone's names plugged into a list here. As you can see, I've just made it white. You might be able to see the faint outlines there when I select it. Just made it white for a bit of privacy, and I'll announce the winners when they're actually picked. Before I do the actual giveaway, though, I just want to thank Direct Game Cards again for giving me the copy, uh, giving me the copies of Heart of the Swarm to give away to you guys. I actually ordered my own copy of Heart of the Swarm to get uh, for myself <laughs> through these guys because it was like really cheap. It was like ten dollars cheaper than I could have bought it from Blizzard. And uh, as you can see. It's all, it's all happened good. I upgraded my account just fine this morning. Got the key on, on time. It was like a little picture of a key code and pretty smooth stuff. So uh, I highly recommend if you guys want to, you know, try and get any games cheaper before you like try and buy them on Steam or Origin or, you know, through Blizzard and things like that to try these guys. I'll put a link in the description below uh, that if you buy through that, it'll help me out as well. So they're kicking me back a few percent of whatever sale uh, goes through that link so that, you know, I can continue doing what I love. I think I'll also be able to put a, uh, a code down the bottom that'll give you an extra 5% off so you can save a little bit more, a couple dollars more. So let's do this giveaway. So I've got 1 to 172 for all the entrants and the number corresponding to the name will be the winner. So let's go ahead and do number one, drum roll, generate, 84, let's go down and scroll down 84, and whoa, there we go, let's make them automatic. Pascal. Pascal, congratulations mate. I'll be sending you a message on Facebook pretty soon. Sorry I just popped up your link there. Hopefully I can block that out in the editing. <laughs> Let's go ahead and give away the second copy now. Number four. Alright, nice and early back here. Let's go ahead and make you like there. Wong Young. Excellent. Congratulations mate. I'll be sending both of you guys uh, the key codes essentially through Facebook, through a Facebook message very shortly, probably at the same time as I upload this message. So if you're seeing this, you should probably go check out your Facebook account. Thanks to everyone who entered the competition. It was a lot of fun reading all your messages and uh, some of you guys had like pretty funny, funny limericks and things like that as well. Uh, and thanks to everyone for liking my new Facebook page. Uh, just a reminder that Facebook page is up and running now. It's something I didn't do for a long time, but I was convinced to, you know, make one now. And I've I've been enjoying it so far. It's been a good way to communicate with a few of you guys. It seems uh, fairly interactive, probably a bit more so than Twitter, which I used to prefer. So anyway, go check that out as well. I'll put a link in the description below. Ah, anyway, while I have your attention, I just want to uh, mention that I do plan on covering some Heart of the Swarm content. I'm not entirely sure what yet, because I tend to make like a lot of guides with, um, you know, like Path of Exile and Diablo 3 and things like that. And I sort of have in my head now a good idea of how to go about making guides and how to find topics for them. But StarCraft 2 is a little bit different. I've played a lot of StarCraft 2 in the past. It's actually a big part of who I am as a gamer. But uh, covering it is something I haven't really done much of. So if you guys have any, like, ideas or requests of things that I could cover, uh, especially things that, you know, are sort of guides, uh, then please do let me know, send me a message, or leave them in the comments below. I'm thinking at the moment that maybe I'll like cover some coaching sessions that I do, or either I get coached by other coaches. Maybe I'll do some like coach reviews. Uh, you know, I'll, I'll cover some strategies. Maybe I'll go over some builds and things like that. Uh, you know, maybe some more specific things, like uh, a lot of what I did on learningsc2.com, like beginners sort of guides. And I don't know, maybe I'll do the campaign. I'm not too sure yet. Maybe I'll just enjoy that for myself. There's going to be a lot of people like Husky covering the campaign anyway. And you guys will probably enjoy watching them a lot more than me anyway. <laughs> anyway. Anyway. <laughs> That's it for now. I'm Ziggy D. And thanks for watching.